Okay, we defined the, the idea of continuity before. A function f is continuous at a point x equals a if the limit as x approaches a of f of x equals f of a. But we have a further definition. If a function f is continuous at every point in its domain, then we call f a continuous function. So when we say continuous function, we mean it's continuous at every point in its domain. Let's take a look at some examples. So all power functions are continuous. For example, f of x equals x cubed. That's a power function. It's defined for all real numbers. So it's continuous everywhere it's defined. It's continuous, I'll abbreviate that, c-o-n-t, on the interval from negative infinity to infinity. g of x equals x to the negative 2. That's also a power function. It's continuous everywhere it's defined. Right? This is the same as, by the way, 1 over x squared. This will be continuous for all x except 0. Continuous for x not 0. And how about one more? Well, let's call it h of x. h of x equals x to the 1 half. This is the same as the square root of x, but it is a power function. This is only defined for x greater than or equal to 0. But it's a power function, so it's continuous everywhere it's defined. It's continuous for x greater than or equal to 0. So remember, all power functions are continuous. Then all exponential functions are continuous. Examples, f of x equals uh, 3 to the x. g of x equals 10 to the x h of x equals e to the x. All of these functions, all exponential functions, are continuous everywhere. They're defined for all real numbers, so all of them are continuous from negative infinity to infinity. And one more class of functions, logarithmic functions, are continuous functions. Now, they're only defined for positive numbers, but still, they're continuous everywhere they're defined. So they're continuous. Mm, examples would be f of x equals uh, the common log. Log base 10 is the common log, right? It's often written this way, log x. That's an example of a log function. g of x equals log base 1 third of x, another log function. And hopefully you remember log base e of x. That's the natural log of x. All three of these guys are defined only for positive values of x. And so that's where they're continuous. They're continuous for x greater than 0. So once again, a continuous function is a function that's continuous at every point in its domain.